goes running and running and running. Yeah. Hey, how you doing there? I'm Dan. I play guitar in the band Zebrahead, and we are doing a guitar tutorial today for the song Public Enemy Number One. Since we're kind of short on time, I got to. Uh, you know, kind of juggle the things I'm doing here, so I'm multitasking today, so I hope you guys don't mind. It's kind of a shitty guitar tutorial, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so, anyways, um, we'll start off with tuning. We'll tune to E flat. This is E string is an E flat, so everything else is down a half step. So when I say E, I actually mean E flat, but we'll see when we get there. Song public enemy number one is based upon uh, the E minor scale and also the E minor harmonic scale. So the two scales would be like this. I mean. So that's the first uh, E minor scale that we're basing the song on, and also this one. That's the E minor harmonic scale, E harmonic minor, and uh, the difference in the note is basically we're sharpening the seventh note, and the seventh note in this is the D. So that's the only difference there. When we get to the solo, I'll explain that, because that changes also. So the beginning of the song starts off with uh, the intro, so it goes um, on the 7th fret, on the A string, uh, power chord, we go, and then we do octaves, uh, we're doing the 12th fret on the A up to the 14th fret, so we, one step, and two uh, pick attacks on the 14th fret octave, second time around we go, and then we go to the 8th fret on the E string, Power chord. Then we do the octaves, the tenth fret to the twelfth fret, and then we go to the third fret, and then we go from the twelfth to the tenth fret uh, harmonic. I mean, sorry, the harmonics uh, octaves on the E string, and then the next part goes on the fifth fret power chord on the A string, and. The only thing we do differently for the second chord there is we put our second finger down to make this chord. So we put our second finger down on the sixth fret. So it sounds like this. And there is also a harmony that goes along with it. The same chords, the different octaves are. So we're doing the ninth fret to the tenth fret octave. Seventh to ninth octaves on the A string, and we go from the ninth to the seventh fret. And the next part is just an E chord, triplets. So those chords are it's a third fret A to second fret A, like a slide, pick a verse, and, slide, and we go to the second fret on the E string, and the third fret back to the second fret power chord. So we got that part. Next part, we're doing uh, <clears throat> the part where it says we bleed, we bleed, we know. A goes. So those octaves are sixth fret, A string, back down to the second fret, back to the sixth fret. And the chorus kicks in. 7th fret A string, 3rd fret A string power chord, 5th fret power chord, and 2nd fret power chord. Switch the very tail end of it, the octaves, we're up to the 14 fret octave. We'll do 14, 12 to 14, back and forth. So. Back 
can do the intro riff and then you're way actually gonna have all those other parts. Uh, the next part of the song that we need to focus on is the solo. The solo does a key change. <coughs> it goes to um, the key of B. It's a B uh, harmonic minor. So that scale is uh, starting on the seventh fret of the E string. Seven, nine, ten. Seven, nine, ten, A. Then um, eight, nine on the D string. So, um, the rhythm for the solo goes like this. So that is <coughs> triplets, um, along with uh, letting it ring out a little bit on the 7th fret, power chord, E. And I'm going to do again. Pick on the seventh fret to the sixth fret, then the sixth fret power chord to the fifth fret, and then the fifth fret power chord to the third fret, and then the third fret power chord to the opening. Aha, so that's the very end part of the rhythm of the solo. So what we're doing there, instead of going down to the third fret from the instead of doing that this, this fifth fret to the third fret power chord, we're doing this fifth fret on the E up to the fifth fret on the A. So and then we do from the fifth fret A up to the sixth fret. And that's and then we go into triplets right after that. And all we do is kind of double up what we're doing in the verse. Sorry, scratch that. Then we do back to the alto. And then it goes into the rest of the song, which is, you know, all those parts already. I'm actually playing the guitar solo. Um, <clears throat> so our solo starts off like this. So this is all in the key of B, um, B harmonic minor. So we're doing on the B string on the 10th fret of the B string, we're doing a full step bend. And then we're doing a full step bend on the 12th fret of the B. And then we do a full step bend up on the 12th fret of the E. There's 12, bend, pick the 12th fret of E, 10th fret. There's 9, 10, 9. And this next little bend is that part is doing the ninth fret on the E string, doing a half step bend. Then from the ninth fret, seven, nine, and to the sixth fret on the E. So that part goes. And for this next part, this next run is. So it's very slowly, 11th fret, B, 7th fret, B, 8, so 7, 11, uh, 8, 7, the 9th fret, G, 7th fret, G, 6th fret, G, back up, back up, then we go up to the 7th um, fret on the high E. Here is seven, nine, ten. So seven, nine, ten, twelve. Then we do nine, ten, twelve, fourteen. Then we do ten, twelve, fourteen. Uh, and then we go into. So here we go. Yeah. Okay, got it now. Yeah. Of course. Yes, please. Thank you. Yes, I do want coffee, but you never ask. So.
14, 15. And this last note here is a good old 18th fret. And so from there, this next run, we do, we're doing um, diminished sweeps, three string sweeps. So, so doing, it's uh, 18, 15 on E to 17, B, then we go to 18, G, and then we go 15, G. Then we go down third, three frets away from there, 12, 15 on the G, 14, B, 12, E, 15, E. And we're doing a sliding in between. So from here is 12, 9 on the E, 11, B, 12, G, 9, G. Slide again. Then we go down to the 6th fret, 6 um, on the G, up to the 9 on the G, up to the 8th fret on the B, up to the 6th fret on the high E, and then the 9th fret of uh, the high E. There we go. So this riff, little riff here, this run, <coughs> we're doing a similar to hard, um, diminished variation as well. So we're doing six, nine. Six, nine. And we do three, six hammer on blow. With the open E string in between. So we're doing nine, 12, open E, 12, 15. Is this run here where it goes up? So. so this is seventh fret, seven on the high, the high E string, seven, three, six, seven, and up to the ninth fret. fret here and, and then pops out of there and that is pretty much the entire song so uh, if you don't mind I gotta clean up a little bit here and I'll see you next time for the next song thank you very much Bye.